previously on For the Love of Ray J. Are we making out? I feel like me and Ray J really connected earlier. <laughs> Danger. So I got the first class again, and I'm probably doing better than the others. We're I'm like, that's coming tonight. out of that pretty girl? Are you serious? That's what my boyfriend told me. Caviar. She slipped up. She said, my boyfriend. I mean, oh, my, my ex-boyfriend. Are you here for the love of Raja? I felt relieved that he did not go on no fake rumors of she said, he said. But you a bomb and shy and backing away. Genuine. You do want to be in the entertainment world. I'm going to have to let both of y'all go. Whew. It's about to get crazy. My name is Ray J. Singer, songwriter, actor, and platinum selling artist. I've had a lot of success and made a lot of money. I love the ladies, and the ladies love me. But after years of being a Hollywood player, maybe it's time to get serious and find that girl who can make me change my ways. Maybe. How many of us are there? There's 10 girls left. Yep, it's That's 10 girls. Crazy to That's me. five and five. What did he call first? Danger. And he called Danger again the first, first night. First night. Yeah. There's 10 girls left, and my game face is definitely on. Danger is my biggest competition right now because getting the first class two nights in a row is a big deal. And I was still in top three, but still. Ray J gives me the champagne glass first, and I feel so great because I know that it shows all the other girls that he likes me the most, and he showed them twice in a row. Hey. How y'all feeling? Y'all all feeling good? We are good. I want to chill for a minute. I'm going to get a drink. Y'all want a drink? Can you lick it off me? I'll be the aftertaste. Right now, I really don't know where I stand with Ray, mm -hmm. so I really need to get in there and step it up. You know? Five, six, ten. ten. You ready? But you better look it good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Eliminations are over. The girls are starting to make late night moves. <laughs> now suck it, girl. That was the best shot I've ever had in my life. I'm sure. Now everybody's relaxed. Everybody's chilling. Everybody's on unwind mode. Look at him. Look at him. He ain't having love. Groupie love. That's, of course, groupie love. He's not going to remember any of this tomorrow. Yeah, he won't remember any of them. Look at him. Me, unique, wash dishes. By the party girls were over there trying to get Ray drone. I'll catch him when he's sober. Right now, the house is basically divided between two cliques. The classier ladies, and you have more of the whores. You need to get somebody nice to share. <laughs> <laughs> Please help me be good. Take a shot off her. No. I want you to. Do it. She got on her Do it, time. girl. Can you Dang me? Why you be looking like that? She doesn't like to share. I'm feeling kind of pissed off because all these other girls are just annoying me. Fair, I want to go in your bed. You do? Spicy. They're just annoying people. Maybe we can work something out. Everybody just seems so tacky and desperate, and it really bugs me. I'm about to go to sleep in a minute. Don't forget up on me. Wow. Uh, I had an incredible night. Of course, I would have loved to end it a different way but I felt like the mature thing to do was to just go ahead and go to sleep and just start fresh tomorrow. Good morning! Hi, honey! Hi. Don't we look oh awake? God. Little B comes in and of course is like, hey, girl! Your man has a message for you guys and we gotta go check it out. Follow me. And we know as soon as we hear that, that something's about to pop off. Ladies, good morning. What it do? If you really like me or you say you love me, then you gotta know who I am. You gotta know what I like. So today I put together a game challenge to see who's been paying attention to what I like and who I am. You know what, we've been in the house for a minute now. So I think it's time for me to put them to the test and see which girl knows the most about me. Ladies, put your game faces on. It's about to go down. We are ready. He wants to know who knows him the best. So I knew that I probably had an advantage over some of the girls that were always drunk and really didn't pay attention to anything that he liked. 
Ladies, 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 welcome, welcome to Ray J's Foxy Feud. So we arrived to Ray J's Foxy Feud, and the setting is hot. There's two podiums with glasses of champagne, it's a plasma TV, it's a buzzer in the middle. So I'm thinking, we're about to play a game. Now look, this game is really gonna show me who's really been paying attention to who I am and what I like. Now, y'all gotta split up in the teams, and we're gonna do it like this. Caviar, Chardonnay, Lil' Hood, Cocktail Feisty. Y'all are called the Divas, okay? Unique, Danger, Stilts, Cashmere Stacks. You guys are the darlings. I'm so relieved that I'm not on Caviar's team. She doesn't care, she barely speak English, and she doesn't know what the hell she's doing. I need y'all to split up in the teams right now. Let's do this. Even though I hate all these on my team, I think that we are smarter than the other team, by far. Now listen, I need y'all to choose a team captain. The winning team captain will go out on a solo date with me tonight, okay? And the rest of the winning team, I'll take y'all on a hot group date tomorrow. Let's make it happen, ladies. You wanna do it? It's so crucial that our team wins. I have to be the one that goes on that solo date. That date's mine. It's mine. Come on, Divas. Lil Hood, OK? Lil Hood is the team captain. Stilts is the other team captain. Now, it wouldn't be right if Ray J's Foxy Feud didn't have a host. Please make some noise for my friend, Tommy Davis. <laughs> What's up, ladies? How y'all feel? Ray J in the house, man. What's, What's up, up, man? How you doing, baby? I'm glad to be here, man. I saw your movie. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm ready to play this game. You ready, you ready to get this thing started? I'll, let's do it. All the ladies in the house say, Al. Al! And you don't stop. Let's get this thing started, let's Ray go, J. Baby. Come, Come on, right baby. here. Now, let's meet the Darling family. Come on, darling. I'd like to get into that family. It's very important for me to win this competition. I really need a date with him just to have a little one-on-one -on -one time to get to know, you know, who I really am. And their opponents, let's meet the Diva family. It's about to go down, and I'm nervous as hell right now. I am just hoping to God I'm gonna win this one because the last time I sucked All right, so ladies, let's get to the rules of the game, okay? For each question, Ray J's top five answers are on the board. It's your job to figure out what Ray J said, all right? So the point of the game is to guess what Ray likes. The more answers you get correct, the more points you get. And the team with the most points at the end wins the challenge. All right, ladies, what do you say? Let's get ready to play this game. All right! Come on, let me see those captains. Y'all come on out here. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, Stills! Woo! OK, your man Ray J was surveyed. His top five answers are on the board, all right? Are you ready for the question? Hand over buzzers. I'm out there facing Little Hood. I'm confident as hell, because I know Little Hood is nervous going up against me. I'm living on borrowed time with Ray right now. Borrowed time. So I need this date. Coming up next. One more of these strikes, you guys. My ladies over here get to steal the board. It's all on me now. I just can't get the answer on. Ray J's favorite way to relax. And later. Hey, Larry, are you with me? You know, caviar is in there talking to a guy. So my target for today is caviar, and the truth is, has to come out. Eliminations are tonight, and she needs to go. Are you ready? Get it, girl. Ray paired us up in teams, and he wants to see how much we know him. OK, your man Ray J was surveyed. His top five answers are on the board. Hand over buzzers. What is Ray J's favorite place on a woman's body? Breast. Do we see breasts? Is it? Yeah, in your face. I know my man. Holla. <laughs> so now she got the number three answer, which is breast. Can you do better than that? What do you think, huh? The booty. The booty. All right, all right. Do we see the booty up there? Oh wow. You know what? I guess he likes them breasts is better than he like that booty booty. So y'all got this thing. Let's see what y'all got, huh? All right, let's see. I'm feeling so pissed off right now because the darlings get control right away. So far, we got breasts and booty. You got another chance to have a dancer. Let's see what you got here, huh? Lips. Do we have lips? All right, lips, okay, all right. All right, let's do this. What do you think? Pops. What are Ray J's favorite body parts? Mm. We're doing good so far. Um, I think it might be eyes. Let me see if we see eyes. Ready, do we got eyes? So, Ray J's 
favorite body part now, all right? I would say legs. Legs, okay. Woo! Legs. Good answer, good answer. Good answer. Good answer. All right, do I see legs? Oh! One strike. On, what you got for me? One. Feet. Feet? Feet. We gonna try that? Yes. All right. On, All right. Do we see feet? Ah, oh, that's two. Okay, okay. All right, you guys got two strikes already. Okay, now if you don't get this, my ladies over here get an opportunity to steal the board. So, here we go. I look up at the board, I'm just like, oh, please. If they get it wrong, we could totally get this right and get some points on the board. The pressure seems to come back to the captain. What is Ray J's favorite part on a woman's body? I'm gonna have to go with the hips. The hips? Woo! All right, do we see hips? It's 150, darling. The Divas, zero. It feels so good. So it's time for that next round. Let's bring these next two players up to the podium. Let's do this, y'all. Come on. Danger and feisty, baby. All right. Let's do something. All right, hands over buzzers. Get ready for the question. What is Ray J's favorite way to relax? Right music. Do we see it? Do we got right music? All right, she got the number five answer. Now it's your turn to see if you can take this for the Divas. I'm feeling confident right now. I think we kind of have an idea about what he likes and what he doesn't like. Um, Ray J's favorite way to relax. Playing video games. Playing video games? Do we see video games? Oh, wow. They get the board again. All right, so ladies, you're one up again. Let's try this. So what do you think? What's Ray J's favorite uh, way to relax? I would say, corny as it sounds, reading. Do I see reading? It feels good that we're winning because it shows that we ladies know him a lot better. Ray J's favorite way to relax? Chilling at the house. Here we got chilling at the crib. Oh, all right, you guys got one strike. All right, we're getting down to it now. Let's hope you don't get another one because they're hungry, okay? So I'm gonna go with watching movies. Do I see watching movie? Survey. No, that's two strikes. One more of these strikes, you guys, and the other girls are gonna finally get an opportunity to do this. So, it's up to you, Stilts, again. I'm feeling so nervous right now. It's all on me now. One more, and our girls get to play finally. And you don't know what's gonna happen when they get up. <laughs> all right? Ray J's favorite way to relax. I have to okay. say hanging around family. Okay, hanging around family, okay. Relaxing with family. All right, relaxing with family. Do I got relaxing with family? Oh, finally, okay, you guys struck out. Finally, what's up, girls? You better clap it up. All you guys gotta do is get one answer right to steal the board, all right? Okay. Come, girls. All right. So I'm like, yeah, because now it's our turn again, and we could totally get this right and get some points on the board. I want to hear what you got to say, Ray J's favorite way to relax. Have a drink. Have a drink? Yes. Favorite drink. Receive that 40 points. We are destroying the other team. It's sad. 190. Oh, oh. It's so discouraging and I'm so sad I like almost want to quit. All right, ladies, let's take a look at his other ways to relax. Number four way to relax was getting a massage. Number two is on the beach. Okay, and the number one answer. With a beautiful day. Time for round three. Let's get our next two players on up here. Let's do this. We have to get control of the board because we have to catch up. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking up at Caviar and she looks confused. And I'm like, Lord, please let this girl understand the rules of the game. Tell me Ray J's favorite place to have sex. Right. Here go your chance, all right? I'm just like, so? Um. 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 The bedroom. So Tommy asks what Ray's favorite place to have sex is. Caviar says the bedroom. 
The bedroom? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if you're married, if you're like mom and dad just having sex in the bedroom like an old married couple, come on, it's Ray. Like, he's he's a freak. Do we got the bedroom? It's just getting worse in the car. Go! Nemo, all right! And worse. His jet or airplane. <laughs> and even more bad. Jacuzzi. <laughs> we're just all frustrated and we're just embarrassed right now. In public. Oh! Favorite um, place to have I sex? I would say on a yacht. On a yacht? Oh, <laughs> okay. Ray J's favorite place to have sex. On the kitchen table. On the kitchen table? Oh, oh that's three strikes. It goes to the divas. Woo! Woo! Finally, we have a chance to get something right. I got one more board to clear. You guys don't get this one? <clears throat> Somebody else gets to go on this here date. Yeah, damn, ladies. I mean, y'all got no points. Y'all don't know nothing about me? We're going to get this Okay, one. okay. Show me that you know some. We have one chance left, and that's it. This is killing me because I want that date so bad. Ray J's favorite place to have sex. In a chair. In a chair? Okay. Ray J says. Oh, oh okay. Ray J's answer. In the rain. Okay, stilts. So you get that special solo day. What's up with that? Tonight's the night. I get my one-on-one -on -one time with Ray finally, and he gets to see me. Stilts all the way, baby. Looks like he's gonna need a chair. It was a slaughter, you know what I'm saying? Like, the darlings dominated, and the divas disappointed me. I, no I just, points yeah, later. I, I know, I know. I know. None. I don't understand. It's not fair, it's not fair. Coming up next. I don't like you guys. Bitch, I don't like you. Danger walks around like she feels like she owns this house. You think you so slick, you're not. Like, we're, everybody's on to you already. Like, I give a And later. I know Caviar's not here for Ray, so I'm thinking I need to get some dirt to get her out of here. But you trying to win and marry this dude? Oh, you know I'm not. I suck, dude. I'm a loser. I hate losing. I feel like a piece of right now. So we get to the house and here I am finding myself so upset. I know for a fact that Ray's really disappointed in us that it seemed like we didn't know anything about him. But you know what? What I really truly, truly hope is that he saw that we, we tried. We genuinely tried. <laughs> I don't know. Danger seems to know what she's doing. We, we might want to start listening to her, you know? What's her game? I gotta I figure know. it out. Like, we don't know what he likes. Like, obviously, Danger's doing something. Now I know, like, what people, like, football players in the Super Bowl feel like when they lose the Super Bowl. Yeah. Or, like, in the Olympics when they don't win their, like, gold medal. Yeah. Hey, Daddy. Hey, Chris. How you doing? I'm gonna be okay. I'll just come because I know you had the surgery today. I really need to call my mom. I'll be a minute. Hello? Yeah, you don't have to be such a bitch about it. What'd you say? Say so you don't have to be such a bitch about it. It's not about being a bitch about it. I'm telling you, I had to do the same exact thing. That needs to learn some manners. It's not what you say to people, it's how you say it. If you said, I'm gonna be off in a minute, I'll come get you. That's different than saying, I'll be off when I'm off. Hello? I definitely feel like Danger feels that she has a big advantage on the home compared to all the other girls. She walks around like she feels like she owns this house. Love you too. Okay. It pissed me the off. I'm gonna cuss her ass out when she get off the phone. She said, I'm glad you were on my team because I don't like those other girls. Bitch, we don't like you either. The so still just came into our room and told us that Danger came to her and said that she didn't like any of us. That right there just pissed us off. I'm not gonna sit up here and go behind your back. Bitch, I don't like you. It is what it is. And I hope she hear me. And hope she hear me with her mama on the phone, too. We're still sad. Right here, Ray. You ready? Looking good. Hi. 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 I got my eye on you, boo. Right. Whatever. You, right there. I'm the, I'm the only one that got my eyes on him. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yes.
something that I felt like she needed to see from me. And that's going to the studio. Nice. Mmm. Still. Hi, nice. How are you? Nice this is my you. engineer. We walk into the studio and I'm like, wow. It's unbelievable. You know, this is his passion. This is what he loves to do. All right, let me get it from right there. I'm going in. There. I was just like, oh my gosh, like, this is hot. I felt really, really special. Like, hey, I, I know, know what it's about now. <laughs> Silk told us that Danger doesn't like the three of us. So we all decide we're looking for her in the house, can't find her anywhere, of course. So we see her outside on the swing, and I'm just like fired up, and we're like, about to let her have it. Let her know, like, she's not gonna talk about any of us and get away with it. Did you tell Silk that you didn't like us? Yeah. What's your problem? Like, what is your problem? I don't like you guys, and you guys don't like me. It's not a big deal. We don't always have to get along with competition. These already don't like me and they all decide that they're gonna team up against little old me, like, I give a You don't really care if women can't stand your ass. I just wanna know. No, I don't care. Okay. If I live my life every day for other people you like me. You ain't gotta think about yes. nobody, but don't yeah. realistically. I, I wouldn't be myself. I mean, and I'm just and that's fine. Guys, we don't like, really you don't want like you to me, change who you are. That's okay. Ray wants a woman here for him, not here to make friends. If you, if you have something with her, her, say to her, don't like, go through the room. Why would you just come to me? She knows she's gonna tell us. No one's gonna tell us. Go back and get books back. You know, that's like sneaky. Yeah, it's just sneaky. You think you're so slick, you're not. And then when I'm on the phone, and you are gonna say, I don't have to be a bitch about it? Is that what you said? Yeah. If you see me on the Phone. Why would you even say that? You had said something like, oh, I'll be done in a minute. Like, just, like, just me And that's me what off. I meant. I'll yeah. be done okay. when, in a minute. Are you guys done? Because I really want to enjoy this by myself. Yeah, you're kind of weird. I'm yeah. sure you would. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Nice talk. So me, Kashmir, and Stax are going to be at that date tomorrow. We totally plan to shut her out of this entire day. So yeah, talk to me. Talk so, to me. What you wanna know? I mean, I don't know. All you right, know so about me. Dude, you know, know you know a little you. bit about me. So we sitting down and we chilling and we starting to talk. And we starting to notice something shiny on the ring finger. What's up with that ring? Um, well, legally I'm still married. Did you just tell me? So y'all still married, but y'all like off and on still? No, we're not off and on anymore. Like, that's dead. That's yeah. done. He does his thing. You don't got no feelings for him no more? It's over. Not Why y'all never person. got fully divorced then? It's going to happen, but I don't think it's been that important because it's not like I've found anybody. Right. That's why we talking, but I'm case, all, I'm all I tripped out because, I mean, I ain't really tripped out like that. I'm, I, I'm But it's like, you should have straight up was like, yo, my husband, you know what I mean? I'm about to wrap this up off top. Look, for real, I'm here for you. No, look at me. I'm serious, right? All right? It's still our love to honesty and appreciation. You know, leaving the studio, I still felt the chemistry with him. You know, there was some emotions and affection there. Cool, come on. Come here. <laughs> Even though I don't really know how to feel about Stilts being married, she kept it real with me and she was honest. And at least I can respect that. All right, we can go by to our song. <laughs> yeah, let's ride out. Coming up next. Take a walk on the wild side, baby. It's like every time we turn around, they was holding hands, touching and rubbing each other. What is going on? She's not that hot. No matter how much they talk about, it's not gonna sway how he feels for me. And later, I've been hearing all kind of crazy stuff all day. All of this different information is definitely gonna affect elimination tonight. I'm nervous as all hell. I don't know what Ray's thinking. I think it's time to do this. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I wake up today and I realize that 
This is my first date with Ray, and I am so excited. Well, you know your man has a message. Are you guys ready to hear it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, yo, ladies, get your ass up. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> yo, Ray J's Foxy Few was crazy last night, right? Danger, cashmere, stacks, unique. Well, I'm gonna take y'all out today, ladies, to some of my favorite stores in Beverly Hills. All right, y'all with that? <laughs> When Ray tells the darlings that they get to go shopping, they start shouting and hooting like crazy cows. <laughs> then it's like, really? Are you excited about the date or are you excited about shopping, gold digger? All right, see you in a minute. Bye. Ladies, come on. Bro. Really out of my element. I don't know what to do. Call my photographer friend who always gives me good advice. I don't know what to do. Okay, how you click with him? You click with him? I don't know, Lear. It's like everybody's all up on him. I know Caviar's not here for Ray, so I'm thinking I need to get some dirt to get her out of here. I don't know. It's not easy. I know. Do whatever you can to play the game. We're trying to work on something for where you benefit from this. So just see how many days you can get out of it. But you trying to win and marry this dude? <laughs> yeah, you know game. I'm not. No. <laughs> Love you, pretty girl. All right, Larry. The losers get to hang around the house and mope around and do nothing. You know, Caviar's in there talking to a guy. Wow, uh, for real? Yeah, for real. I'm really trying to get some on Caviar because I'm not feeling her. Eliminations are tonight and she needs to go. Ray needs to know who the hell is here for him and I need to filter out and weed out the girls that don't belong here. Do you guys know anything about stills? Just what she's told me. Was she, was she married? That I don't know. I have no idea. Look at her ring finger, you guys. You guys didn't notice that? I wish there was like a way for us to like just put everyone on blast and find out everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, why are you here? I love this shop. Love Beverly Hills. I wanted them to go shopping in a place where I felt like they were gonna have to get used to the territory they were in. And could they actually handle that? Now, what up? Yo, what up? We get a nice selection of ladies, Ray J. This is what it's like to be on Ray's arm, paparazzi, the whole nine. This is the life I've always wanted. Want to look them up, man. Want Unique stacks in cashmere. Love the paparazzi. They're posing. Excuse me. This is like Christmas for them. I've been paying attention to my girls, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm in the store. It seemed like Stax, Cashmere, and Unique were in a team. They were enjoying each other, <laughs> enjoying the scene, enjoying each shopping. That's really cute. But I felt like they kind of blocked me out just a little bit. OK, I'm going to find something. But on this shopping date, I, I didn't want to be ignored. Take a walk on the wild side, baby. Take a walk on the wild side. I was like, what is going on with you? Like, she's not that hot. That's what I'm talking about, baby. She's built like a Pepto-Bismol bottle, like up and down, no curves. I think it's hilarious because no matter how much they talk about, it's not going to sway how he feels for me. Yeah, danger. She was looking at us like, yeah, aha. Uh -huh. You know, like taunting us, like, aha, uh -huh, I have him now. I feel it coming on. I'm a cousin out. So what did your friends say when you were like, I'm going to go on the show? I mean, I didn't really tell nobody. I don't know, I heard about it. My photographer called me and he was like, you know, it's more serious. It's not gonna be like no other show. So you model? I don't modeling, yeah. So your photographer told you about mm -hmm. it? What? Are you serious with that answer? Like, <laughs> Caviar has a little slip up. She says that her photographer told her that this would be you know, good for her exposure. You're here to be a model with your photographer. To convince you to get on to the show, you not because show. you found out it was going to be him and you wanted to be on it, but because you got convinced. Because whatever. How'd your date go? We just had dinner and talked. It went how it went. 
So Stills doesn't say much about what happened on the date, which makes me wonder what they did. It wasn't a bad talk, it was a serious talk, so. It just depends what type of man he is. If he's strong enough to deal with what we talked about, then I'll be here. If he's not strong enough to deal with it, then I'll be going home tonight. That's as simple as that. So I'm gonna tell Ray what she said because he's clearly a man in my eyes. No, this guy gotta be even. It gotta be like in the middle. Okay, I've never done this before. <laughs> So we're done doing our research for the day and Chardonnay and I get candles from around the house and massage oil and rose petals and set it up in Ray's room so that we can have a little massage session. We decided that this would be the perfect time to let him know the dirt that we got on the girls because he's not gonna know unless one of us tells him. So I get back, walk in the room. Whoa, hey, hey. Candles everywhere. Roses in the bed. Baby oil. Whatever it is, I know it's gonna be good for me. What's up? Did you get the message? Yeah. Don't wanna massage me? No, sit down, get comfortable. Hell yeah. So while Chardonnay and I are giving Ray a massage, we decide to tell him everything that we found out from the girls. It's just a couple people that I'm kinda um, questioning caviar, she's just so not not in the mix. So I'm just like, okay, so how did you find out about this? Were you excited when you found out that it was him? <laughs> like, were you happy? Like, do you even know who he and is? And she said the way she found out about the whole show was that her photographer was, told her that it would be a good him. idea for her exposure. Yo, when I find out caviar is in it for the fame and not in it for Ray J, that's when I need to start eliminating folk. So who else? Well, me and Stills were having a conversation. I don't know what was said between y'all, but this is the thing. She said, if Ray wants to eliminate me, that means he's not as strong enough of a man to deal with a real woman like me. It's confusing. I got a lot to think about. She just told him, here for the ride, basically. All of this different information that I'm getting from the girls is definitely gonna affect my decision at elimination tonight. and Caviar is definitely in danger of going home tonight because she's not here for Ray. She's always on the phone with some boy and she's definitely here for exposure and nothing else. I just think Ray should move past the fact that I'm legally married because I had enough guts to come to him as a woman and tell him, look, this is my situation. But it could be he respects me for telling him what I told him or he could be like, I can't deal with it. You know, still you gotta bounce. Ladies, it's time to let somebody go tonight. It, it gets harder and harder and harder for me to do this. But I've been hearing all kind of crazy stuff all day, and I don't like that. So let's get to it. Chardonnay. You're looking good, you know? We vibing. So I just want to know one thing. Are you here for the love of Ray J? I am so happy that Ray called my name first because now that means that danger Miss Always Gets Her Glass First didn't. So I feel real good right now. Cocktail. I just want to know, are you here for the love of Ray J? Always. All right. Danger. Danger being picked ahead of me, of course I'm pissed again. It's like he's giving her more reason to make her feel like she's better than everybody else in the house. I was very upset about that. You're still holding it down. I just want to know, are you here for the love of Ray J? Yes. Blessings to you. Yo, Stacks. You hella cool. I just want to know, are you here for the love of Ray J? Yes. Blessings. Mm -hmm. Unique. Seem like you went in for the right reasons. Just want to know, you went in for the love of Ray J? Of course I am. Feisty, come here. <laughs> Are you ready for the love of Ray J? Sure. All right, baby. Slow down, girl. 
Hello, hood. Are you here for the love of Ray J? Of course. That's good, hood. So, what's up, baby? Cashmere, can you come up here real quick? I mean, you're just quiet and you know what's up. I mean, I want to vibe with you, damn. Are you in it for the love of Ray J? Yes. All right. What's up, man? Man. We're down to our final glass. There is one glass left. I'm feeling extremely nervous, because me being married is it's a possibility that I can go. It's one glass left. It's two of us, and I'm very nervous. I don't know what Ray J is thinking about. Coming up next. I got something on my mind. You know what I mean? It's confusing, but I gotta send a girl home. Cocktail, what exactly did she say one more time? We were having a conversation on who we thought was gonna get eliminated. Cocktail is standing right next to me and I'm very pissed. I ain't never say it like that. I wasn't the only one there. This is some I think it's time to do this. I got something on my mind, you know what I mean? Cocktail, remember when we was getting a massage? You said something about some caviar said, you know what I'm saying? That really was like, what? what the, you know what I'm saying? What's, what's popping? What, what exactly did she say one more time? She said that she wasn't sure about coming into this show because she thought it was going to be like some crazy reality show, like Flavor of Flav or whatever. Shout out to the homie. And then she found out it was you. And then she was like, yeah, well, I don't know. But her photographer said that it would be good for her exposure. Cocktail is standing right next to me and I'm very pissed and I'm way bigger than her, so I'm like, let me just keep my cool before I'm just gonna eliminate myself. Caviar, you wanna clear that up one more time for me? Just so what she's saying sounds a little too long. Define too long. Too long, it was, I did not say nothing about exposure. I wasn't the only one there. All right, all right, I see what's up. Whew. Still to stand. Yeah, still to in here. Also, you said something about stilts as well. This is some We were having a conversation on who we thought was gonna get eliminated, and she said that if he eliminates me, he's not gonna be a strong enough man to be able to handle a woman like me in my situation. Whoa, I'm buttoning in on it, because I ain't never say it like that, okay? Mm. Well, if you're gonna say anything, the, the only thing I said was, we spoke about something that was very important and very serious. Mm -hmm. And if he's a strong man, he would be able to deal with what I told him. That's what I said. So That's get it right. Did say. Thank you. She didn't say that. All right. Cocktail is telling me everything about these girls. Now she might lose their trust, but she's gaining mine. Caviar. Everybody said you questioned even being here, and not only that, I mean, you know. It just feels like you're not into me. Stilts. It turns out you're married. I knew it. I knew she wasn't here for him. I knew something was up. Ray calls out that I'm married in front of everybody. And I'm just like, oh my god. Like, I can't believe you just did that. Married? Oh my god, are you freaking me? She's married? For real? That right there makes me like go, damn. I got hurt by that. You know what I'm saying? And you know that. After saying that, I think it's time to do this. and I'm feeling like I'm going home. I'm nervous as all hell, because it could go either way. I'm hoping that I'm staying, but it, it's 50-50. I don't know what Ray's thinking. Stilts, caviar, We're supposed to be one-on-one, -on -one, but I need a woman that's good for me. <sighs> With that being said, Still, still come down here. Ray J called Stokes' name, and I just can't believe that I'm going home. 
so he calls on stilts and I was like, what? I can't believe he's gonna keep the girl that's married. He must really like her. Yes. Come here. Stilts is still in the house. <laughs> what is it, baby? Oh, I talked to you. I know. You told me you was in a weird situation. And it takes a strong man to deal with that. I am a strong man. I just want you to know that. But it's not about me being strong. It's about you being strong enough to end one relationship before completely starting another relationship. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. No matter how cool we vibe and no matter how much we connect, I need a woman that doesn't already have a ring on that finger. This glass ain't for you, all right? I'm not trying to get a divorce. Not until I find somebody that I feel like I want to be with. I'm good. I don't need anybody else. I don't need Ray. I don't need. I don't. I, I don't need anybody else. I'm straight. Caviar, come down and get your glass. You hot? Are you here for the love of Ray J? So Caviar once again gets through elimination somehow. That sneaky snake. But she's. One of these days gonna get caught up so bad that it's just gonna slap her in the face. Saying, can we come down and toast? I know it's intense. I know it's crazy. I know it's crazy, ladies. It's crazy for me too. So let's toast, ladies. Let's keep this thing popping. Welcome to tonight. Next on For the Love of Ray J. We'd like to take this time to welcome everybody out to Ray J's Singer Challenge. Make some noise. All the girls. what I'm doing. I'm literally going to kill her. Tell me, you were your enemy. What's a game? All right, Mary. I'm going to step it up and do something special. Yeah, buddy. Little hood, crazy. Ray is acting so weird at elimination. I'm freaking out right now. I feel like you tried to play me. I don't appreciate that. The motives are ugly. You gotta pack your Right now.